Hi Libra, welcome to your August Tarot Forecast with me. This is Brooke. Welcome back to Night for Tarot. Thank you for joining me. This is your August Tarot reading for the month. Please make sure to watch for your Sun, Moon, Rising in this video. So Libra, I have pre-shuffled. We're going to lay out the cards together and see what's in store for you for August. And if you see smoke coming across the street, <laughs> screen, that's incense. <laughs> Just to let you know, it's juniper incense to be exact. We come in with the Queen of Wands energy for the month. We could be dealing with fire signs, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, but we're also dealing with very persuasive, dynamic people. The Queen of Wands makes an entrance, okay? She's very charismatic, very attractive. This could be Libra yourselves taking on this personality, or this is your personality, okay? This also could indicate other people. This could be with events, business, boss, friends, family, however it applies for Libra this month. So she's dynamic. She goes after what she wants, and that may be the mentality of you this month, Libra, okay? With the Queen of Wands energy. Next, we have a major arcana chariot. So overcoming difficulties this month. Nothing is getting in your way. Motivation, determination. You are driven this month, Libra, to go after what you want. Okay? You're focused. You have the focus. You've got the right mentality. You've got the drive, the determination and you're on your way. So that's a very positive card. When I see the chariot, it's essentially, we're gonna do this, okay? We're gonna get this done, we're gonna get through this, we're gonna do this. Next, we come in with the lovers. So the lovers in this case, very much a crossroads. There's a choice to, do, to be determined this month for Libra. This may be a path that you may choose to take in terms of career, success. Opportunities may unfold for you this month as well. Because of your drive, because, because of your hard work and determination, you may even be offered for many some sort of business contract, negotiation, offer, okay? So you may have a choice this month or you may feel as if you're at a crossroads especially for opportunity in the month of August. Here we come in now the most recent past with the Four of Swords energy. There's been a rest period the last few months for Libra of kind of not getting so caught up, okay, in external circumstances. You've kind of taken a step back so you can refocus, rethink. You've had a retreat period. Okay, but now is when the work is coming in. We have the six of coins. So once again, there could have been an offer. There could have been a financial offer to Libra coming out of the most recent past. Maybe you didn't act on it, okay? Maybe you were kind of like, mm, I'm going to stand back for a minute, all right, just to look at my options coming out of the most recent past. So there has been some sort of offering. This also could have been financial contributions, donations, generosity through financial gifting. Okay, so that's enabled Libra to continue your endeavors, your projects, etc. Here we come with the Ten of Cups energy, very much focused upon the family, feeling comfortable this month, good times. It's also one where you know that you're going to be okay. It's a sense of security. It's a sense of comfort. It's a sense of home. Looking around and feeling safe. Okay, when I see the Ten of Cups, there's no nervous energy. It's very much contentment, security, family, joy, children, marriage. You know, it's family. It's those cozy moments. It's the sense of security and fulfillment, which is nice to see. The Six of Wands is next to this, so there's victory. So we're victorious this month, especially this month going into September. A lot of recognition coming in from other people for Libra this month as well. So you're being recognized for your efforts, 
This may come in the form of award, recognition. Okay, other people are applauding your success. So that's very positive. So I feel for Libra for August that you're moving. You're moving up, okay? You're going forward. And you may have felt like the last three or four months that, oh, yes, got to do this, got to do that. Kind of a waiting period, but in the behind the scenes, you've been working your ass off. People may not have noticed this or had any idea, but you've been working at something, and now you're starting to really see good success results come in from your efforts in the month of August. Here we have home again. So things on the home front are looking really positive. So also this could be for some selling a home, purchasing a home, remodeling your home, happy times around the home, events in the home, celebrations in the home. Okay, so something's very much centered around the home for Libra this month as well with the Four of Wands energy. Next to this, we have another Wands card, the Two of Wands. So any type of major decision, opportunity, business partnership, business opportunity is going to be released this month in terms of unlocking it and perhaps accepting the offer. If you've been offered a contract, an employment offer, okay, if you've been offered even for students an internship, okay, so something's coming up for Libra this month that's going to be accepted, okay, you're going to accept the offer this month coming in, in the month of August. The Nine of Wands tells me that you're very much sacrificing yourself to make this work. You want this. You're defending your idea. You're defending your situation. You want it to work, okay? You are basically giving yourself to it, okay? You're now, here I am. <laughs> Take me for all it's worth. I want this so bad. I'm going to do everything that I can to get it. Plus, you're very defensive of your idea. You're defending your dream, so to speak, when I see the Nine of Wands energy. Here we come in with the wheel. And this deck, it's the Wheel of Fortune, of course. So the wheel, the cycle's spinning for Libra. This is ushering you into a new cycle. Okay, this is really a time of luck, synchronicities. Okay, things are changing for the better for Libra this month. You're going into or being ushered into a brand new cycle coming in. If you have been content, discontented the last three to four months, okay, the focus is now upon the goal. You, the goal was always there. Okay, when I see this card, the goal was always in front of you. It was always there. There could have been too much traffic coming from other people's opinions or, you know, being bombarded by things on social media, listening to other people, having some confusion and doubt within yourself. But it was always there. Okay? It's always been there. So try not to focus too much on, oh, well, what other people think you should be doing or what you think you should be doing because other people are pressuring you to do this. Follow your gut instincts, Libra, because it's really directing you into something that is very prosperous. We come in with the Ace of Coins energy. Prosperity, abundance, new cycle financial. Okay, this could be promotions. This could be business endeavors, making money. More money's coming in. More streams of money is coming in this month for Libra. So a new cycle of prosperity from this Libra it's going to be lucrative for many of you that are watching. So I'm going to stop with the ace. <laughs> That's my favorite ace in the deck, isn't it for you? <laughs> the ace of coins. So you can't get any better than that. <laughs> so definitely I see for you this month new cycles, money, opportunities, okay? Saying yes to an offer, taking the offer, acceptance of it. Things are changing. The cycle is changing. Good, good feelings around the home. Comforting feelings of security, okay, emotionally, financially. Good month, Libra, so I'm happy to see that for you. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. You can also check out my website if you'd like to book a private reading and check out my social media links below. Have a great month, Libra.
and I'll speak to you soon.